So people might be wondering, why would you even set the blanket down if you're gonna throw your TV off of the deck? What's up everyone, it's Noah here with Mad Shenanz. I've been meaning to do this video for a while. Actually, a lot of things behind the scenes that we've wanted to share. And so in this video, we're going to give you a behind the scene look at some things that you might not have noticed when you watched the first time, some things that you may have never known about Mad Shenanz. So this one's actually really funny for a few reasons. One of them was this was actually in our dad's tubby phase where he was pretty chubby. And so it was intentional that we hit him while he was sitting and eating because we wanted to spoil his food. And lo and behold, that's exactly what happened. We hit him with that balloon and the water got all in his chips. He had to throw those chips away, had to get up, move around, burn some calories that way. And now he's in great shape, he does keto, so. In one way or another, 50 ways to pop a water balloon saved his piggy life. Smash a like if you think he should be grateful and thank us for what we did for his health. Hey, your brother when he's sleeping. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so as you might have guessed, Blake wasn't actually sleeping in that chair, but his reaction was still genuine because if you look back in the video, Connor whipped that balloon at him as hard as he could. It left a huge welt. And so when Blake scrambled out of that chair to attack Connor, it was actually because he was just so mad at how hard he was hit, like knocked the air out of him. After the shot was done filming, he was still beating on him. So it, it was a genuine reaction. Hit Joey right at his face. Hit Joey. Not in the face. <laughs> so of course, this has got to be one of my favorite pops in the history. The one where Joey just absolutely gets clapped by a balloon, and I mean clapped. Wow. There were so many that hit him perfect, but they didn't pop, and you need to have the balloon pop for 50 ways to pop a water balloon. So what ended up happening is we just got all these shots of him getting hit really hard with the balloon and it not popping. And then eventually they were not aiming for his face. They were actually aiming right below it, but it got him in the face and it ended up being the opening sequence for 50 ways to pop a water balloon. Drop a TV on it. Oh, 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 no. So people might be wondering, why would you even set the blanket down if you're gonna throw your TV off of the deck? Our parents actually said we could only do that if we put a blanket down so it would catch all the glass and it wouldn't get all over the lawn. And so the reaction of like, oh no, was genuine because the TV rolled off of the blanket, hit the cement and shattered all over the lawn and we knew we were gonna have to spend hours picking up that glass afterwards. No, pee on it. There's about three or four hundred different comments on this video asking whether that urine is genuine or not. I'll let you guys be the judge. Leave a comment below whether it's fake or real, and maybe in the next video I'll let you know. Throw it from a moving car. So from the beginning, 50 Ways to Pop a Water Balloon has always been something that kids in the neighborhood all did together. And so this was for part three, so we were kind of starting to take off and these kids really just wanted to be in the shot. And so we had three of them lined up because it was kind of hard to actually throw a water balloon from a moving car. And so we figured if we had three kids all stand next to each other, it would increase the odds. Lo and behold, it wasn't just a good shot, but I would say a perfect shot. <laughs> 